Okay, y'all, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am back, same outfit. I'm going to be doing another part to this top 10 series. As you can see by this title, this one is going to be my top 10, or however many I can list, favorite grocery stores or places to go for like food, goods, and overall places like, for example, in America when you go to Target or Walmart, stores like that. I remember when we first came, we didn't know where to go. We just was going to Saracunda for like everything. So when we found out about these stores, we were this is pretty much where we always go for like our groceries. And uh, if you want to buy things in bulk, like toilet paper, stuff for the house, pretty much. Um, this is where we typically go. And I think this video will be very helpful for those of you who are coming to Gambia for the first time, moving here, or even on vacation, and you want to go out for a certain thing but you don't know which store to go to or which store will have it so hopefully this video will help you yeah i think i think it should because uh a lot of these stores that i'm gonna list have a lot of stuff in them a lot of up-to-date stuff so yeah here we go let's start off with this video uh first off i'm gonna start by saying right choice that is a very common grocery store here we go there a lot uh, they have one in turntable they got one in freaking i think they got one in saracunda westfield yeah i think they got one there they got one in traffic light they got one in city gambia they got one in dang near everywhere right choice is very common supermarket here it's like a walgreens they got everything you can get pretty much everything there all foods that you're looking for you can get a right choice next i would have to say is my supermarket my supermarket is located in kololi next to this one club named big apple um yeah they have everything there as well not as much as some of these ones i'm gonna list coming soon but they got a lot of stuff they got a lot of stuff that is i think a lot of it comes from the uk they have a lot a lot of different cereals a lot of different sweets chips everything anything you can find in a grocery store you'll find there so my supermarket is a good place if you're looking to buy in bulk yeah we get our big cases of chicken and yeah if we choose to get chicken that's where we get it from yeah, our water we get from there like our big bulks of water we get from there water bottles so yeah my supermarket is a great place next i'll have to say is target yes they got a target here and i remember when I was in school, like my school days here. And they got a lot of actually good stuff. I was like so excited to go there because they have so many different good stuff there. Stuff from like America, from the UK, like the original stuff. And um, yeah, I always get excited going in there sometimes because like they got a lot of different like sweets that I used to love in America, like the original ones too. So yeah, some of it is a bit overpriced, I get, they are shipping it from America, so I guess they gotta make their profit, whatever, but at least make it reasonable. Like a small packet of, this little small itty bitty packet of fruit snacks for like 15 Delossi, which is less than a quarter, okay? But when you live here, you you know what I mean. Like, you know some things is 15 Delossi, you get a lot for it. Then you just have this small little thing for 15 Delossi. It's just, even if it's less than a quarter, it's just that 15 Delossi can go much longer or for something even bigger than a smaller pack of this thing, fruit snacks. So yeah, but they do have a lot of different stuff to choose from. Next, I will have to say is um, Pick and Save. Pick and Save is located in Kotu, I believe. They got a lot of stuff. Before I knew about Target, I knew about Pick and Save. Pick and Save is very similar to Target here in Fajara. Very similar. Um, they got a lot of stuff a lot of stuff from america and these places like a lot of american brands that i'm used to and i remember one time oh my god i wish they brought it back but i remember one time they had hot cheetos there that was like me and my mom was so happy that day and not even not only just hot uh hot cheetos but they had hot fries they had hot cheetos there so ever since that we've seen that hot cheetos were there like we always go there every other day and yeah they got a lot of good stuff there. Next, I will have to say is um, Express at the Village. Uh, the Village guys, when I say the Village, those of you who are not in Gambia, I don't mean like a village. There's a place here, like a whole complex plaza type thing that they call the Village. 
it's next to Sin again, babe. There's a store there called Express and they have so many different good stuff, so many different goods. Make sure you go and check out Express. We usually get our dog food from Express. If you have a lot of dogs or just a dog in general, they got um good dog food there. Next, I'll have to say is there's this one guy in Manjai. If you know, you know that he sells a lot, and I mean a lot of stuff from America because he imports a lot of stuff from Atlanta, I believe, in like a container and he sells it here. He is super overpriced, like way overpriced. But sometimes when you negotiate with him, he'll give you a deal or he'll uh, bring it down, the price down, because if you're from America and you live there, you know god dang well that some of this stuff is not the price that he's saying. So you get kind of like, like we know that it's not the price. So how are you gonna try and say that it's this price? Like, okay, you need to get profit. But that is just like dramatic, some of the stuff he would like charge. So you really gotta negotiate with him, but he got some really good stuff there, like so many good stuff, junk food, which is not that healthy, but if you're looking for like some of your favorite junk foods that you used to have in America, you gotta check that place out. I wish I had his number. I wish I had his number so I could like, his number or his information to put on the screen so you guys know where to get it. But if I could describe where he is, if you can search for this one store called Lulu Ray, he's located near there, I believe. He's past there, just a little bit past that store. He got everything there from toilet paper to water, the water bottle packages to cereal, to chips, to beauty products, to, to medicine, to cleaning products, to vegan options of like food and stuff. It's just, he got a lot of stuff. But the way that he has it set up is very like packed inside of the little small shop that he has. So I wish it was a bit organized because it would be a lot easier to find stuff at that store. But yeah, just know he has a lot of good stuff. So make sure you check it out. I wish I had his number or his information so I can let y'all know because that store is really, he has a lot of good stuff, but yeah. Next, I'll have to say is Hewal or Hewal. Hewal, I hope I'm pronouncing it right, I don't know. Let me just say Hewal, because I'm not even gonna try and act like I know how to pronounce it the, the proper way. But um, yeah, there they have a lot of American goods as well. They sell from America. They import from America as well. I think we found out about that store way before we found out about Pick and Save and My Supermarket Right Choice and all that. We used to go there consistently the most and still to this day we still go there they have a lot of american stuff and just good good grocery stuff and snacks so if you're looking for a good place to go and get some like good snacks and groceries and american goodies then make sure you go to hewa or hewa of course i have to mention this it's not necessarily a grocery store but it kind of is in a way because you can go there for your groceries and you can get a really good amount of stuff for a low price, a lower price than if you were to get it at any of these stores that I mentioned. Like you really get a good bang for your buck when you go to Saracunda. Saracunda and buying like vegetables, fruits and all of like your produce or whatever. Getting it at Saracunda, you get a lot more for cheaper or any of these markets for that matter, like you get a lot more for cheaper price. If you're vegan, vegetarian, you're looking to, or in general, you just wanna buy a, a lot of vegetables and fruits and stuff for your house, then make sure you go to Saracunda. Like you're not gonna get a better price anywhere else than if you go to the market. And yeah, and as I said, everywhere, most places it's negotiable, like at the market. So you can always talk them, talk them down on the price. So that's one thing I really do like about um, shopping in Saracuna and stuff. You can always negotiate. In the stores, you can't do that, of course. So yeah, at the market, you can definitely negotiate and you get a lot more for a cheaper price at Saracuna. So that's definitely where we also, like before we even, as I mentioned earlier, before we used to go to, we went to any of these other like stores, like Right Choice and all this stuff. We was at Saracuna buying everything. When it came to meat, we would buy the fly meat, as my parents like to say, call it fly meat with flies on it. All the fruits and stuff, mangoes. We used to buy so many mangoes before we realized that there's freaking mangoes growing in our backyard. Mangoes, bananas, we grow ban ban our own bananas now too, thankfully. A lot of this stuff now, we don't even really go to Saracone anymore because now 
we've grown it ourselves. So yeah, if you guys watch my parents' videos, that's another good tip, gardening. If you get the stuff from Saracunda, fruits or whatever, save the seeds and you can plant it and eventually have your own stuff so you won't even have to go to Saracunda no more. And that's exactly what my mom and my dad do. They took all the seeds they, they used to always get from like fruits here. We would always have to give it to them and they would save it and then they would plant it and boom. Now they got their own banana trees, watermelons, cucumbers, jalapenos, peppers, and just all this stuff, all because we saved our seeds and, you know, we went through with the gardening and did all that. Yeah, I am um, digressing as, again, but yeah, so Saracuna is definitely a great spot. So if you wanna go grocery shopping and you want it at the cheapest price and save your money, go to Saracuna. Another one that is like a big favorite of like my parents, it, and me as well is Discount Center in Fajara. I'm so glad that we actually took the day, that one day that we went in there to go inside there and look and see what they got because they got a lot of good stuff. And it, their name, their name actually matches with what they sell. When they say Discount Center, they mean it because they got a lot of stuff that is discounted and at the clearance, um, like proper stuff for like a low price and you can always make deals with them. I know I said earlier that some of these stores you can't really negotiate with them as you can like in the market, but there's this one guy like we actually, um, who works there, who is cool and he's always giving us deals on stuff. So shout out to him. Uh, he's always giving deals at Discount Center to us. And yeah, like for buying the one thing, he'd be like, he would throw in this thing and say, oh, you can take this too, or you can take that too. Or, cause he knows that we usually buy a lot there and grocery shop there a lot. So yeah, Discount Center is a really good place to shop at. Like that's probably like our favorite like place to shop for groceries at, at this moment. If you are looking for some good stuff for a good price after Saracuda, Discount Center is a really good spot, y'all. They got everything. Also guys, one I forgot to mention, I can't believe I forgot it, but Maroons. Maroons is a really great supermarket you can go to. They have a lot of stuff as well. I think most of their products come from um, the UK, I believe. A lot of great stuff to choose from at Maroons in Code 2. And that's pretty much all the places I can think of right now going grocery shopping. Those are pretty much all the places that we normally go to uh, when we want to buy stuff for the house, uh, grocery stuff, hygiene products, body wash, hair stuff. Yeah, they have that, all those stores. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys visit all of these places and I hope I was able to help those of you who may have just came here or been here who have not heard of these places. I hope that I was able to help in some type of way and yeah, make sure you go check them out and I hope you guys find some good stuff there. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys all in my next video. So until then, much love.